save every save that yeah. you had long ago. Yeah, you know, it was just a little adjustment from last time out. You know, you, it's amazing how close you can be and you can give up seven runs and ten hits and, you know, feel like you're right there. So, you know, it was definitely a learning experience last time out and then to come out today and pound the zone and especially against that lineup of lefties, you know, because that's what Colorado did to me. Um, so to come out and throw a lot of strikes and, you know, get some nice ground outs and even the hits, uh, you know, I was pretty comfortable with. Um, yeah, it felt good. It was, it was nice. How y'all talking about changing there. speeds better? Is mm -hmm. that something that you worked on out there? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I think, uh, you know, that I think that last start I was was cruising, you know, through the whole spring, feeling great. And I think I just let that get to my head a little bit and just start trying to throw instead of really make good pitches. And, and today I kind of slowed myself down and, and uh, stepped off a couple times, took a deep breath and, and really threw the pitch that, that, you know, that me and Gio, you know, felt like was the best pitch. And, and I think we were on the same page all day today. And uh, especially there towards the latter, you know, three, four innings, I didn't really shake all that much. Me and Gio were, were right where we needed to be. Oh, I feel pretty good, man. You know, uh, yeah, just looking at my camp as a whole, uh, yeah, uh, there's really not much I can say other than that last outing. But, um, yeah, I, I feel great. And, and uh, you know, obviously we'll see what happens, but I'm, I'm really not too worried about it. Yeah. <laughs> well, he had a great cutter all day, man. You couldn't pick it up, and everybody was swinging right over the top of it, and he left it over the plate a little bit. And, and uh, yeah, I just kept running, so. It was nice. It was fun, man. That's you know. Then that's why I wanted to start. That's what I've been preaching for for years now. That you know, I want to be an athlete. I want to I want to hit. I want to run the bases. I want to field my position. And that's been a big part for me to so to put it on you know on paper and show that I can do it. And it means a lot to me. And uh, you know, obviously, want to continue that through the season. But uh, it was it was fun. I had a good time. Yeah, it was there. I mean, I might not have the recovery as quick, you know, but I don't think you have to run another triple after you run a triple. So. Yeah, it's it's still there. It's still there. Has this been your best spring, you think? Absolutely. You know, I really learned a lot over these past, you know, five spring trainings. You know, being a young guy, you got to come into camp like spring is, is the season. You know, I mean, unless you got a six-year deal and, and eight years in the big leagues, you know, nothing's for sure in camp. So um, I didn't take anything for granted this year. I've been out here early, did the same thing I did last year. And I just wanted to be ready to go for camp so I knew that whatever happened, you know, I left it all out there and was ready to go for camp. Yeah, I mean, just w what I surprised myself with is my consistency so far in spring, you know, I mean, just being in the zone, but good pitches in the zone, you know, not just get me over sliders and get me over fastballs. I've been throwing good location and down in the zone and for me, that, that excites me because I know as the season goes along, you need to make those those pitches and get quick outs. And, and uh, you know, that's what I'm excited about, especially to get in once the weather warms up in, in midsummer and really have your arm come around. You know, I'm, I'm excited. And uh, I'm excited to have an approach on the mound that I haven't had before and, and a game plan and sticking to it. So, yeah, I mean, I think there's I think there's still a lot left in there that we can tap into, but, uh, you know, we'll gradually get there. Yep.